You see, I've got this friend in L.A. who owes me a favor. Because I took a bullet for him one time. And, well, these guys he owed some money to were chasing him down an alley. And, and, hell, I was just tagging along. I didn't know what was going on. But they started shooting and missed my friend but got me in the shoulder. I mean, I mean, look at that scar. It's a beaut, ain't it? <laughs> and all this time, you were thinking that was a birthmark. Well, he said if there was anything that he could ever do for me, to just ask. And, well, after all, I kind of sort of saved the guy's life. And, and guess what? This friend has an uncle in the movie business, a producer. I'm going to run my screenplay by him, and I just know he's going to love it. It's got everything Hollywood loves. Car crashes, drugs, raw, unbridled sex with a heavy emphasis on unbridled. <laughs> and you, baby. You are going to be the femme fatale. All those years of acting classes are going to pay off. I'm so excited. I mean, there's just a million thoughts running through my head. All right, but first, baby, we've got to surround ourselves with all the accoutrements of major Hollywood players. Got to get us some clothes from Rodeo Drive or maybe the closet thrift store and, and shades. Got to have shades and maybe a small dog and, and a cell phone. Because you ain't shit without a cell phone. And, and well, hell, who says it's got to work? Just carry one. And we've got to ditch our car, baby. Who's going to take us seriously if we're driving a 1990 Oldsmobile with Kentucky plates? I mean, just image is everything, baby. Everything. Uh, got to have us an entourage, some hangers on. and uh, My cousin Leon lives in L.A. He's currently unemployed. We'll give him some beer and cigarette money to be a hanger-on and a gopher. Uh, just keep your eye on him. He's a little loopy. He had a head injury a few years back. And uh, Well, speaking of money, how much do you have, baby? Five dollars? Well, that might be a problem. 